Hey Exiles, how are we doing? We are back again playing some more Saga of Survival. How are we doing guys? Hope you guys are all well. Right, let's get to it. So, we have a little event that's popped up on the developer page. And if you guys know already, which you should, as we sort of get towards the end of the month, we have Halloween. And what the developers have done is they've set up a little Halloween fan art contest. So I suggest you guys um, head down over to the Facebook page if you guys haven't done so already. But um, have a look and have a bit of a read. But I'm going to read it out whilst I get over to the Cursed Forest because this is where it's all being themed for. So, hello Exiles. It's time to get spooky. It is that time of year again for our Halloween art contest. The theme this year will be Ghouls of the Cursed Forest. We all know how much fun our dark and cursed Stormfall enemies are, so why not show them some appreciation by making some awesome fan art, right? So what they've done is they've just given us an idea of what the placements will be for prizes. So um, there will be uh, a grand prize, just one on only, so Uno. Uh, winner this year uh, will get a Grand Master Repair Hammer and a Rare Scroll Set. Second to third place will be Rare Scroll Sets. And fourth and fifth place will be a Rare Scroll Only. Now, to participate, all you need is to create your own fan art and post it um, on the forum in the comments to the Halloween fan art content, uh, contest in uh, now that's a thread on the game, so you guys got to head down into the game forum um, and basically post it in there. Post the ima uh, images uh, on that first th uh, thread. Your chances of winning will depend on the number of likes of your submission. Now the contest will end on November 7th. Winners will be announced on November 15th. So they've given us a little bit of leeway and a bit of time there before um, uh, we get the winners and conclusion for the set event now it will it's only a themed event so not an update or anything like that so i really don't want to um disappoint you guys for that or anything in such so look it is what it is um it's something and hopefully we will be getting something um hopefully shortly so i also wanted to point your attention to the that post as well so when the post came out on, and I think this was on Tuesday, okay, and at the time of this recording, this would have been on the 15th, if I'm not mistaken, or the 14th, depending on where you guys are in the world. Anyway, um, look, a lot of negative comments have come through um, on that post, and negative comments about the game, where it's at development-wise, and why hasn't there been an update. And look, guys, um, I think it's been made um, uh, common knowledge before, but they have been updating uh, inside the background of the game. They've recently upgraded their um, gaming engine to a newer model, and that's going to give us a lot more um, upgrade ability for future updates uh, moving forward. So we don't obviously know what they are right now in terms of uh, timeline and what's to come. But I just wanted to point your attention there, and we've got to give these guys a bit of, um, well, I wouldn't say slack, but just give them some time until that they are ready for, you know, newer updates and what they're planning on. Now, considering that it has been um, at least three months since the last update, to my knowledge, if I'm not mistaken, uh, quote me if I'm wrong or if I'm right, but... Uh, I'm hoping that's been giving them enough time to... Uh, pretty much get themselves sorted and organized and hopefully we will have um, a, a decent update and something uh, worthwhile the wait so that's what I'm hoping for and I hope you guys um, are patient I know there's a lot of people that are basically um, either fed up with the game or just wanting to have, to have a little bit of answer context things like that and hopefully you guys will have um, some you know, a little bit of leeway and patience until the developers are ready to go with the, the new update. Um, with that, hang on, just got to sort of get my bone breaker. Sorry about that. So, um, yeah, guys, so like I said, 
just give these guys a bit of uh, time and hopefully we will get something special hopefully soon but going through all the comments um, I've got to say guys I mean it's a game it's a free game that everyone's playing and the the demands and the um, well look poor choice of comments you know given towards the game developers I don't think that's on and I'm not trying to I'm not sitting here to defend the developers or anything like that um, I want new content as much as the next pe uh, person but um, I'm also patient as well so um, patience is a virtual and good things come to those who wait and I think that's going to be key here and I hope you guys do understand that and I hope you guys are patient enough waiting for you know the next update which I'm hoping that's very soon I am trying to push the developers and ask them quite actively um, on the uh, developer discord so I'm hoping you know I'll, I will get something shortly but so far nothing's come through yet so I am pestering the moderators and to their credit uh, the moderators have done a fantastic job and trying to moderate that post as well that's been uh, put up for the Halloween contest so um, you know th they don't make the game or anything like that but they're just here to hopefully shed some information or some you know uh, assurances that there will be some sort of update shortly but again as we said we obviously don't know what's happening right now at the moment so hopefully something do does come along soon but I'm just hoping you guys will stay on the patient side so when it does come through you guys are going to be you know a little bit more happier so um, that's really what I wanted to say about that guys um, you know like I said I hope you guys do have a bit of patience behind it and hopefully soon um, you know something comes along and you know we can get back to really enjoying the game like we have in the past so that's what i'm hoping for and i'm hoping for that for everybody not just for myself but uh for the rest of you that watch my videos but also everyone that really plays the game uh, couldn't let me open that okay so unfortunately my curse points uh on max which is fine i don't really care to be honest with you but what annoys me is I don't get to open up any of my chests in peace, so here we are. And I just have to rely on my heels and everything else in between. Oop. I want to open up, no, I want to open up this. Open, 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 thank you very much. And let's open up the chests and see what type of loot that we have here. But I think that should be all the bone breakers in this level of the Cursed Forest. And I thought I figured I thought I'd just come down to the Curse Forest and just you know use this time here so you guys can um, maybe get an idea for the event itself, itself as well. Hopefully you guys um, will participate. Um, let's get some people uploading um, some nice little fan art and things like that. And I really hope you guys actually win. You know, a Grandmaster's hammer. We actually don't know what that is. And once I open up this chest. We'll Definitely go ahead and see what we do have from a hammer perspective. So once I open this up, I'm just waiting. Hopefully now, come on, two, one. Alrighty, so sorry guys. Uh, let's just heal up, take that with us, and move on. Alright, come on here, Dungeon Spider. Let me take you down and you as well. Yeah, so what actually that's what I wanted to do. Um ba, 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 where are we? There should be I think there is a hammer set. I have actually no idea. I thought for some reason there was some sort of um hammer set or something or other, but anyway. I really thought there was. No? Okay. Hmm. Oh, here we are. That's what I was. Anyway, you've got workman's hammer, assistant hammer, novice hammers, but there is also expert hammers as well, which I don't have at the moment because I did use them up beforehand before uh, filming the video. But anyway, that was to get my um, uh, my, my staff back up to a bit of um, 
uh, usability. But anyway, a grand, so there's expert hammer and then I was assuming that the, above the expert hammer will be the grand master's hammer. And we really don't know how much durability that's going to give or um, how much um, ability it's going to give us to repair items. Um, I don't know whether or not it's going to be a, um, a hammer that will get your, say, legendary item, whether that be, say, like the elemental star, for example, or whatever it might be, whether it be um, it allows you to re... Uh, generate or sorry repair a full set of legendary armor who knows but uh, that's what I'm thinking it's got to be you know some sort of legendary capable repair hammer that's what I think that's that that's what it has to be so let me know what you guys think in the comment section about that down below I'm interested to know your thoughts about that but hopefully um, like I said one of you lucky guys might uh, experience uh, the win there and get yourself the rare scroll. Uh, sorry, what was it? The rare scroll set. Now, rare scroll set. I have absolutely no idea what that's all about. Uh, what type of um, uh, whether it be you know armor, uh, weapon bound, or you know who knows. I honestly have absolutely no idea what that might be or what that might entail. But yeah, who knows. But hopefully, um, yeah, whoever wins will get to show it off, I guess. Um, and at least there'll be some sort of post, whether that would be through either the Discord or I would hope um, through the in-game uh, forum. And at least that way, um, you know, we'll, you know, take a peek at it and hopefully you guys will, yeah, be able to see it as well. Um, I'm just sort of double track, uh, double backing here, just seeing if I've missed anything. I probably have. But I really want to get into the lower levels and um, keep going through. Um, and I'll probably leave a few items behind as well because I'm not going to need them when I'm down there as well. I'm just picking up some scrolls for the uh, upcoming XP challenge anyway. So let's go ahead and drop some of these things off. And I will leave that behind. I will not need that. And I'll just keep what I've got here. Righty, let's get into it. I'm going to swap this over and let's go smash some golems up. Okay. Oop. Let's just sneak up on you. Okay. Oh, right. That, that wasn't intentional, but that's happened. Okay. Oop. And the guy that I probably was chasing, who knows... Anyway, at least I got a hit on him before he got a hit on me. And they're all coming. Come guys, come one, come all. Ooh, fire call. Thank you very much. And I'm just going to take all the clay as you do. It's easy clay. That's why I love coming down here. Just grabbing as much clay as possible. I've got a stack of clay at home anyway, by the way. So um, I've been trying, I guess, to turn them into clay brick um, but to be honest I haven't had too much success at the moment so I've had a lot of other things occupying myself at the moment um, you know uh, real life wise and uh, sort of trying to juggle uh, the last couple of weeks to a month uh, compared to what I've been able to do in the past so yeah it's been a bit of a pain on my end here which I haven't really progressed in the game as much as I would like to and like I said it really comes down to just my personal life at the moment so nothing bad or anything like that so if you guys are wondering but just things that keeps me occupied from actually playing you know um, this game and other games as well that I really want to sort of get involved with at the same time so yeah I mean look I mean I, th I think I spoke about it a little while back just seeing you know where I'm sort of heading with um, with the channel and everything else in between but um, hopefully, like I said, eventually I'll sort of get back to, um, you know, an even ground. Why, why is that? Anyway, I'll, I'll put that back. I, I don't really need, uh, the magic dust. I've got quite a lot of magic dust as it is anyway. So anyway, is what it is. But yeah, so just being, um, at it from a, yeah, from a personal life perspective, 
I've you know gone through um, um, I'll probably call it a promotion through work as well so that's sort of occupied my time at the moment um, just been training a lot as well so um, hopefully training's coming towards um, an end and I think I've got one more week to go but uh, training environment versus normal work environment are two different things so you get two different um, well I wouldn't say stresses in life work wise but but you do get some you know um, it wears you down in different ways so you know from a um, I guess from a theoretical point of view to a um, to a practice point of view I guess so yeah so I guess that's something that's happened you know that's happened in the recent time and I've been training for oh, it's probably nearly been five six weeks so it's been quite some time since I have been trained uh, been in the training environment so yeah so they really want us to sort of you know get everything down pat um, in the role that I've sort of taken so and making sure that we've got pretty much everything that we needed I guess before they put us out in the real world I guess that probably makes sense in a way but yeah it is what it is so hopefully um, once I get to settle down I can sort of you know go back to normal and routine wise but the role that I've taken is going to be quite demanding at the same time so and what I mean by that it's a, um, a role that requires me to work um, uh, weird times of the day um, but also it's also going to give um, well require me to work um, overnight so doing the, the old grave, uh, graveyard shifts uh, will happen from time to time so I'm not too sure how that's going to work with uh, me you know obviously play, uh, uploading videos keeping active as well and things like that so that's going to be a challenge when that time comes and I'm not too sure how I'm going to um, uh, cope with it at the moment so I really haven't sort of um, got my head around it yet because I haven't actually uh, entered any sort of overnight uh, work just yet but I just thought I'd share it with you guys just let, letting you guys know uh, what I'm up to and yeah what's happening with me at the moment so hopefully um, you guys will understand if you know there might be some videos that I may not get to upload or um, I might be uploading very little videos um, uh, if none at all so I'm not too sure exactly what that uh, what that's going to mean for me you know in the coming future well in the near future I should say so yeah I'd rather be upfront with you guys and just sort of um, just let you know what's going on as well at the same time so as I said nothing bad at all uh, good thing in a sense from a financial point of view because it's uh, uh, more money than what I was getting beforehand so that's always a plus and yeah hopefully um, uh, it doesn't really impact me too much um, sorry from a um, yeah from a game perspective so yeah just thought I'll share with that with you guys anyway with that being said we are in the swamp so this is why I sort of wanted to come down here as well just to sort of get your creative juices flowing depending on how you guys want to sort of uh, do the fan art contest if you guys are obviously going to uh, participate of course um, things like you know the dark bone breaker could be you know an enemy that you want to um, model your uh, fan art on or do you want to do something like the um, the dark overlord that might be something that you guys might be interested in so yeah so I figured why not come down here let's you know rustle up some feathers here and where's that dark overlord hey where is he? He's normally... Oh, okay. Ah, oh, this game. Um, hopefully, when an update does drop, the um, that type of bug will be squashed as well. But yeah, Dark Overlord. Hopefully, um, we will... Uh, well, some people might want to use this as a basis for their fan art contest. Who knows? But yeah, just sort of giving you guys some ideas, I guess, at the same time. Let's just use all those. And I dealt with the keys. Um, absolutely demolishing everybody in here, as you as you would expect. Being that it's uh, times three curse hit points here, um, you are definitely going to rack up the curse points as well at the same time. So um, is what it is. Anyway, let's move on. Let's go through. Uh, who's over here? Anyone? No one. Okay, cool. So let's move over to the other side. 
and let's avoid him and here we go hey guys how we doing today oh there's a few of you let's just back up a little bit take out one bow uh one bone breaker and let's take out the can we smash out the dark overlord yes we can and let's just take out the second bow breaker there we go absolutely demolish these hey um, do I want these things? I have no idea do I want these things. You know what? Go away. Um, Alright, I'm just going to take them for now because... There we go, that's what I wanted to do. Let's put those back. And... Let's just put these things up here. And I need some a drink. There we go. All right, cool. So back to it. And anyway, let me know down in the comments, actually, what do you guys think that you might want to uh, base your fan art contest on? If you guys are participating, of course. Um, like I said, be interested to know in the comment section. Uh, let me know, see what you guys are up to. Anyway, not going to take any of your ideas, of course, but I'm just interested to know. Anyway, let's see what this chess has to offer. And I think we may have gone through the whole zone, to be honest with you. So um, I think we might leave it here. I'm just going to do a quick rundown um, to the other end as soon as I open up this chest, see what's what. And I'll take that and take that. I'll leave those guys behind. I didn't take a an axe with me, and I always do that because I want to get, you know, being that I'm already down here, I may as well grab uh, the elm log. And yeah. May as well, but I think we've gotten everybody here. Let's just go through the middle. And yeah, pretty much demolished everyone here. And that's all thanks to uh, this staff, of course. So I'll switch back anyway. Put that back aside and yeah, put this away. Yes, I had one back in reserve just in case. Anyway, um, as always, guys, thank you for stopping by, checking out the video. Uh, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't done so already, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. Anyway, guys, I'm going to get out of here, take it easy, and I will catch you next time.